Today, we are continuing our journey in Duck Life 4 with our level 999 hacked Doug. So these are the stats of our Doug. As you can see, I still have to work on the climbing and the jumping. I also got our Duck a brother called Duck 2 because what else would I name him? As you can see, we've completed the mountains, the swamp, and the grass. And so let's go to the glacier. I believe we can learn to climb it. Yep, that looks like climbing. Let's see what these exercises are. This is actually kind of cool. It's definitely nice to have some variety. Okay, so we're going to die here. We're going to see how high our level is going to go up and already you can see it. we are getting a lot of levels we're already level 87 that, that is so much i literally played it for 10 seconds okay well let's go into the second climbing exercise it looks like we just have to watch out for avalanches and try not to die guys has something gone wrong in the game because look at this the time is going down i'm going past these caves and there are no avalanches okay i take it back i take it back i can't believe i just got in there well it looks like we're gonna die the time is gonna run out as well so let's see how high our level has gone up well we're level 330 Okay, let's go to the third one and see if we can get it to level 999. Oh, why? It's speeding up so much already. Why? Why is it so fast already? I was not expecting this. But yeah, this is always one of my favorite mini games in the other Duck Life games, simply because it was just more fun than the other ones. Even though it's pretty simple, it's just a really nice concept. But we're past a score of a thousand, which I definitely wasn't expecting. <laughs> we are going so far in this training. I'm still alive. How am I still alive? Okay, I literally can't see my dog. Okay, I don't even... There we go. I think we died. Now, how far is our level going to go up now? 703. That That is so high. This is definitely one of the games where you can just gain XP seriously fast. As you can see, if I just die right here... In fact, we're not even dying! I'm literally, I'm not clicking anything and we are still alive. How is this happening? Okay, there we go. Finally, we die. And already at level 999. It is so easy to gain experience on that one. Well, now that we are level 999 climbing, let's go and challenge this penguin. I'm so cold. If I don't race, I think I'll freeze to death. I like how this duck is literally a penguin, so he shouldn't freeze. But he's saying he's going to freeze to death if he doesn't race. This duck was pretty cocky about his speed in climbing, but little does he know that I am a hacker duck with level 999. 199 climbing and he does not stand a chance. I already don't like the look of this dog. Let's see what he has to say. Beat me in a race and I'll give you my ticket for the tournament. Okay, that is good. As if that could even happen, I'm going to enjoy beating you. Are you kidding me? I was right. This guy is a jerk. Well, let's show this guy who is the boss around here because he is, he does not seem like a nice dog. So we're going to steal his money. I'm pretty, oh my God, the flying. I forgot how far. <laughs> look at I think that we were meant to go down there, but it little does he know. We have level 999 flying, so we could just fly right over that gap. Yeah, but he's going to get disqualified. The camera did not know what to do, and we just stole his money. Well, let's see how easy the tournament is. Of course, I'm going to choose myself for every single race. Duck 2, you, you're not quite there skill-wise. The devastating charges. Um, no, I that, that is a pretty bad name. Let's just call ourselves Doug. Okay, so we're racing against a pirate, a really bored surfer duck, and obviously I look the coolest. I look the coolest this by far but hopefully we actually manage to finish because sometimes we don't and it looks like everybody is gonna get disqualified that is the perfect start to this well we're on to the second race we still have a viking and some kind of explorer and this guy who's trying to stay warm but he's probably failing okay we got a cliff right there i just love how we just oh no Oh, okay, luckily we did not get a bounce, but we did manage to finish that one. And of course, yeah, they're, they're, okay, you can slightly see them, but they're going to get disqualified. So what happens if I use the turbo boost button when I'm going off a cliff? I have to try. Oh my God. Okay, luckily in this game, if you climb really fast, it doesn't actually affect like the roll. So that's really good. Did we finish the race? Yeah, we did finish the race. Perfect. This is going so well. We disqualified them for the third time in a row. Sucks to be the other ducks. Duck came first against all of these noobs, but let's see. Okay, so we have unlocked the city. Let's go. And then we only have this one left until we face the final boss. Not gonna lie, I really like the aesthetic of this city. It looks so nice. So judging by the jump on that trampoline, this is where we train to jump. And the problem is... We only want to get it up to like 400 because if we get it any higher, it really messes up. Dark Life 1 to 3 did not have jumping in the game. So this is a completely new skill we're about to train. So it looks like we just have to climb up a bunch of stuff. And I'm going to die soon because obviously I don't want to get above like level 300. Otherwise, the game really messes up. Okay, so let's just die right here. We literally just got crushed. Our level is going up pretty quickly. Let's see what level 178 already. Wait, how did that get us so many levels? That is not good. For this one, we have a pogo stick which, oh no, I can already tell. This thing is going to be awful. Oh no, it is so hard to control. I really don't like this. 
But it is a UD. Oh, no. Am I going to die? Okay. Luckily, we did not fall down. But what happens if we fall through the gap? Like, what's going to happen? Do we just fall to the other side of the world? Like, how far does it go down? Be right back. We're just going to fall to Australia here. And let's see how far our level goes up. 261. Okay, we're going to do one more training. And hopefully, we don't get above 300. Because that would be absolutely terrible. So, for this one, I actually have to perform tricks. Okay, that's interesting. So, I have to turn this way. You know, the jumping trainings are actually pretty neat. I actually really like it. Wait, how do we complete a trick? I'm literally just going in circles over here. Well, we went slightly over 300. But I'm... I'm hoping that 321 won't be too high. So we have our first dog in the city. For some reason, he's standing over the shop, but that's okay. I can't swim, so my race is going to include everything else. Let's see how good this dog actually is. Yeah, I don't think he stands a chance. I am just so fast. And you can see, because I have level 321 jumping or something, I jump instantly. Normally, it takes like one second to jump, but I can just do it completely instantly, which is awesome. Well, we have another duck that we can beat up. I'm organizing a deadly race over the city rooftops. Just try not to fall down. Well, obviously, I'm not going to fall down. I'm a hacker dog. There is no way I am ever going to die in this game. Yeah, those are... Dude, how could you fall down those gaps? They are absolutely tiny. Look at this. I jump instantly. And just like that, we have finished the race. I wonder what happens if we use the boost button while we're in the middle of jumping. Like, do we do an extra big jump? I have to test that out. So it looks like we have a final opponent before the tournament. Let's just face him. I'm looking for a good racer to take my place in the tournament. I can't make it. Okay, so we just have to be fast enough to beat him and already we know we are definitely going to be fast enough with these stats wait guys are we breaking into a store or something it looks like there's a shop yeah we <laughs> we're literally vandal okay we're not vandalizing it but we oh my god that was so fast that was so fast and just like that we're really finish and you can see if our jumping or our running was a bit better we would have just flown right over that flag but luckily we took the win we can now enter the tournament in the city so let's go the loony quackers okay normally i just get rid of these names but i kind of like this one those ducks have exactly the same pattern that is kind of neat but it doesn't matter we're just gonna race wait what what we just no no we just got stuck wait can i boost myself out oh my i can't believe it i just boosted myself out no this is terrible though this is why you shouldn't make the jumping high am i gonna be able to win the other races I don't know if I'm going to be able to beat the other races if I get stuck again like that. Okay, we're on the second race. Hopefully, we don't get stuck on anything. I do have the boost button if I really need it. I'm just pre- Guys, no, no. Can you see? Because we jump instantly. No, we're actually stuck forever. We're in purgatory. No, this is terrible. Well, I am just stuck here. I mean, if I come last and I come first in the third race- can I still actually win? I don't know. Well, at least we're not completely soft locked. There is a countdown. The race is over. We got disqualified. If we disqualify everyone else in the next race, can we actually get the win? I'm just praying that we don't get stuck again. Please do not get stuck again. There we go. Oh, look at our flying though. Look at our flying though. That is amazing. So hopefully there are any places that we can get stuck. It looks like, yeah, we're going to disqualify everyone, right? And then hopefully we can still win a question mark. It looks like everyone got disqualified. So first disqualified first. Does that still mean I can win? No, the loony quackers came second. Oh my, we can't win then. We actually can't win. What am I going to do? So I thought I'd never have to use duck two, but I'm actually going to have to use it now. I just have to get a couple of his stats up and only get level 150 and below in the jumping and then i'll enter him in that race only and we should be able to win well let's go and train duck two i can't believe i'm actually training this stupid duck this this is such a plot twist but luckily i don't have to get that many levels i just have to get it so we can get like second on that race also to everybody that subscribed yesterday thank you so much we beat the record of 2,000 subscribers in one day by a ton we got 3,500 subscribers so thank you guys so much if you are enjoying these videos and you haven't already subscribed definitely do so because i'm gonna be doing a lot more duck life i'm probably gonna do other games as well hacks so yeah let's try to hit 10 at thousand likes on this video i know it's probably gonna be hard but i think it might be possible so we have to be really careful training this guy to jump because if it goes anywhere above 150 we can't do anything wait it's actually kind of difficult to lose in this game though like it's it's hard to intentionally lose this may have been a mistake no i'm gonna have to do this again okay we have to intentionally go down one of these holes please Oh, come on. That was so close. Okay, we died. Please don't be above level 150. Please, please. 106. Okay, that is perfect. I was so worried that we get above 150. So we're going to enter Hacker Duck 1 for those two races. And then this one for the middle one. And we should be able to win the Levitating. Okay, we're just, <laughs> such a stupid name, but we're going to go with it. 
Now is the moment of truth, and as you can see, this guy, okay, perfect. He is not that good at jumping, he is not going to get stuck, he's really, really great at flying, so he should get the lead here. We literally haven't even practiced the climbing, but it doesn't even matter. Let's see, oh no, oh no, guys, guys, the swimming, the swimming. Um, let's boost three times, oh no, are we going to actually lose? I actually can't believe it. I didn't train the swimming. Well, we came second again. Time to train swimming. I made it like level 136. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. And we can boost as well. Perfect. We were really close to winning anyway. But now on to the final race. Well, we won this. Perfect. Let's see what unlocks now. The strong cyclone. Stupid name. I know. And now we get to go to the volcano. Let's see what the volcano is all about. Okay. Well, we're at the volcano. It looks like there's a crate. This box is locked with three chains. You'll need three keys to unlock it. So I'm assuming I just have to race these ducks. They're probably going to be pretty difficult. And yeah, let's go. Wait, wait, wait. There's a Lego. I can, <laughs> I can buy a Lego. That's amazing. Guys, I'm a Lego duck now. <laughs> I can't believe that's actually a thing in the game. Well, we got three ducks to challenge, so let's just go straight into the first one. That volcano looks like it could erupt at any second. I found this right key on the floor. Okay, well, let's go. Let's choose our Lego duck. Hopefully, the jumping, there is no jumping that screws us. I mean, I do have my other duck if I really need to. I'm super excited to face the final boss. And oh my, wait, there's lava? There's actually lava, so I'm assuming if you go in the lava, you die, right? But we didn't even have to jump because we just flew over everything. We're going to disqualify the other duck, and we're going to get the key. Okay, so we got the red key. Uh, let's challenge the next start. This place is great. There's so much jumping and climbing. No, I hate jumping. I hate jumping. Orange key. Okay, well, let's see if we can get the orange key. I don't know how to feel about all this lava, guys. <laughs> that is a lot of lava. See, we just jump instantly if it's above 150. And it looks like, are we going to fly over the flag? Hopefully not. No, I don't think we flew over the flag. Amazing. It looks like we're going to get the win on this one as well. In half these races, you can't even see the other duck. We are that fast. We got the second key. Let's go. We only have one key left. Why is there an exclamation mark all the way over there? No idea. Let's challenge the last duck. This race has some steep cliffs. You better be a good climber. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have level 999 climbing, so I'm going to be good for this one. I wish there was more lava in the background because it's just so gray. Like, I mean, my Lego block is pretty colorful. It really stands out against all of the other stuff. This is kind of an interesting race. Like, there's only a slight... Oh, it's over. Never mind, guys. <laughs> well, it looks like we're going to get the final... Final key to unlock the crate. I I don't know what the crate's gonna do. So we got the green, we got the yellow, and we got the red. So let's go. Let's open the box. It's a detonator. I wonder what happens if you push it. I don't want to push this, but I guess we have to to continue the story. So let's push it. Oh no, the volcano has erupted. And what's gonna happen? Okay, it's vibrating. Nice. W what's gonna happen? Anything gonna happen? Oh, I had to click. Okay, so a duck has appeared. Look at this thing. He looks very, very menacing. And of course, we have hacked stats, as you can see. This is going to be very, very easy. You dare to blow up my volcano. Let's see if you can race as well as you can destroy things. But good luck, for I am the undefeated champion of duck racing. Okay, so let's select duck uh, with our Lego brick, and let's see how easy this is going to be. Well, it's counting down. It looks like we don't go automatically. Wait, no! Oh, I can't believe it. My hacks don't work. I actually have to control the duck. No, this is terrible. It's a platformer. I could actually die. Okay, if I die here, that's going to be absolutely terrible. I can't believe it. We can't hack. I'd actually have to do this properly. I mean, that's kind of funny, to be honest. Oh, God, he's really catching up with us. We really... Oh, no. He's getting really close. This is terrible. I was relying on our hacks, and they don't even work. And now we're actually getting behind, and I just died. I actually just got... No, you <laughs> I just lost with hacks. Now I know that it doesn't go automatically. We're going to control this guy and we're going to get the lead. I don't think we could have won anyway because I was too slow because I didn't start at the start. So obviously I did that deliberately. Obviously. Yeah, that guy is actually pretty fast though. Okay, so let's just be careful here. Let's not die. Let's avoid everything. He's still ahead of us, but I think we should get the win, right? I can't believe the hacks don't work though. We're just traveling at regular speed and it looks like we are going to get the win. There we go. In the Lego brick, your dog is the new world champion of dark racing. Here's your crown for the king of ducks. Yes, we got the crown. Look at this thing. I need to put this on. All trainers, train beyond your limits. Um... I'm pretty sure we've already done that <laughs> with hacks. We also got an RK machine. Okay, pretty cool. So we actually beat the game. I mean, obviously we hacked, uh, but the hacks didn't actually count. And I did lose once, but there we go. The golden crown, of course. We're going to give it to our duck. I like how the duck is just hovering there. And look at my one. We're going to rub it in that we have the crown. But yeah, I really hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, tell me in the comment section if you want to see duck life space hack next. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video.